New at 10, stopping mass shootings with cutting edge Kevlar technology. It's a mission for a company formed in the wake of deadly violence plaguing schools and religious institutions. I spoke with a parent and the founders of the company about the cost and the impact of what's now being made available. Across the country and here in Michigan, Ryan and Marianne Cowell are committed to stopping deadly mass tragedies involving schools and places of worship. Because they're installed as shades, really they're kind of out of sight, out of mind, unless you need them in the moment. Based in Charleston, South Carolina, the couple going from state to state to raise awareness about a unique product that can resemble a curtain sliding down to form a bulletproof barrier. Where does your passion for doing this come from? We are the parents of five kids ranging in age from 7 to 23. And when Uvalde, Uvalde happened, it was a real turning point for us. Aligned with company Ballistic Barrier in 2022 and creating forced entry protection, they've worked to fill gaps in security. The products Life Shield Plus and others made in Tennessee have drawn interest from parents and school districts. We're trying to do something to create a space that is secure, but also feels just like a normal school environment. We're installed in California, in Florida, our main focus has been up the eastern seaboard and in Texas. Impactful change remains their goal, but unlike others, they say they found a way to cover costs at the same time. We have a security product that is eligible to be purchased with COVID dollars, unspent COVID dollars. And so, you know, when you when you look at Oxford or, or Michigan State, Michigan as a whole, response to those events in Michigan was $25 million put towards SROs. Our product is between $15 and $20 as a one-time purchase to take care of the entryway in one year. At Michigan State University, updated cameras and door locks have been installed in the wake of a deadly mass shooting in Oxford where a gunman killed four students and wounded others in November 2021 at the high school. Parents have also called for more to be done. The kids are the ones who have to feel comfortable being in those buildings. And if it if it brings any sense of um, security for them, um, then I, I think it's an option that districts should be looking at. Mayday Security Solutions is reaching out to Oxford schools about their products. They're also listening closely to parents demanding more steps be taken. We've also reached out to Oxford schools for comments, but have not yet heard back.